With coronavirus cases climbing here in Mississippi and around the nation, the attention turns to the prospect of a vaccine. And work on a potential COVID serum is happening here in the metro. The great news is that we are actually launching enrollment for our trial uh, the first part of next week. Uh, we've been preparing uh, extensively. Dr. Galen Marshall is a senior chair of allergy and immunology at UMMC. He also serves as executive director of the Mississippi Clinical Research and Trial Center. Marshall says they're looking for as many as 60,000 worldwide volunteers in this study. And he's hopeful that as many as 2,000 of them will be from Mississippi. He says our demographics are well suited for the project and they'll focus on a group of volunteers from a diverse racial, social and economic pool. This is to make sure that we're inclusive of these vulnerable uh, populations that get sicker, higher percentage of them get the illness and more of them that get sick get more severe disease and die. Normally the path to vaccines can take decades. But getting this pandemic under control has scientists working to fast track this project in just months. But there will still be a period of waiting. During the trial, some volunteers will be vaccinated, others will not. And the effects of multiple testing will be studied. We believe these vaccines will work because they're making the immune response that's characteristic of a protective response from other vaccines. But in the final analysis, we're going to have to wait for a period of time. Now, Dr. Marshall tells us if their work yields a vaccine, once we get it, doesn't mean we go back to our normal lives. Scientists will work to determine just how long the shot will offer us protection, something that years of research will need to determine. Marshall also says it is important not to overlook getting a flu shot this year. That is also a virus that can kill.